hey hey Aquarius I am feeling the good tarot not sure where this is going but yeah I feel like to use the good tarot we're just gonna see what we get I have pre-shuffled Aquarius poor Aquarius what does Aquarius need to know okay there you are coming in as the king of air better than the, the queen you're not as you know harsh but it feels like you are uh, kind of in your own you're you're balancing your own life you've got it going on um but there's there feel there's a feeling of loneliness there's a feeling of um oh i don't want to say coldness harshness um because of life or such tell me more May we know more? Messenger of air. Okay. Tell us more. Okay, you're going to get some communication, some message. Um, you're going to have to follow your intuition about this. Because this is going to be something that is going to be very tempting. You know, it's, it's like a temptation. Um, you've got the high priestess here because you need to follow your intuition on this. Follow what you're, you know, don't just, don't just jump on it. And it may be very tempting. You're not in the queen of swords right now. So, you know, you, 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 I feel like you may be dealing with loneliness and such. Um, this is coming in from a king of air. Do not look at how these are just kings because that's energies. Now, there's some reason we've got temptation coming out. You know, that's a 15. Um, this person's going to tempt you. There's something about them that's going to tempt you. And we need to know more about this. Tell us, Spirit. They may need to... They may... Okay, see, you're within your zone. You're in the peace right now. Um... This person may try to take you, you know, away from that. That's what that's what this is. See, it's like you're 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 where you need to be at this moment, and you may not even realize it. But you're you're having this moment of transformation, and the reason you're doing that is because you're going to. It's like you're ending a cycle, and you may not feel like you are. You may feel like nothing's moving, nothing's going anywhere. You're lonely, you know. But it is. It is more than you know. Um, so it's like you're, you know, you're opening, you're going to be opening up to a whole new future. Everything, you know, like changing. The way you look at things changing. And that is what's going to bring the one for you. Or that is what is going to bring people for you. You know, like your soul tribe or such. Because for some of you, you're not wanting romance. Um, see, this person if not careful because see you're going to be moving forward towards you know all the love you need whether that is with someone new or whether that is from family or fur babies or you or whatever you know it's like you know that's where you're headed making your own decisions but this person comes in and if you're not careful how you let them persuade you because with this card right here, I was getting like, you know, kind of swaying you off. Taking you astray. You know how it's like they would follow her. Do you see what I'm saying? Um, because we got the tower. So things could really um, go on hold. It could slow down your progress if you're not careful. If, um, you know... Whatever this person's intentions are, don't let them, you know, if they have bad intentions, don't let them take you away from your path. Okay. Let's see. This King of Earth's intentions. Let's see if we can get a clarify. Strength. King of Earth. So this is someone that's very strong in their own right. Queen of Swords, Nine of Pentacles. Okay. 
This is somebody that was dealing with someone that was very harsh and the Nine of Pentacles is reversed. Um, this is something that they need to heal with the hair font being there. So this person's got healing that they need to do. And it's like you've been doing your healing and they could take you three steps back. Um, it's that type of feeling. This could be some, for some of you, this could be someone from your past because we got the Three of Cups out. Um, and they may have put you in a third party situation where this Queen of Swords was involved. Nine of Pentacles reversed, someone that didn't really know their worth and their value. Someone was in a bad spot, in a bad place. Um, so, yeah, this person could have very well put you in some form of uh, third party situation, whether that was romantic or family oriented or friendship or, you know, they chose job over you, whatever. Um, but you need to look at it before you jump, before you leap. It's that type of feeling. Because it's like you've been doing a lot of work on yourself and you don't want to take three steps back. Change in the wind. Things are about to change for you. You see what I'm saying? It's you've been working on it. You've been doing this. You've been doing it. Uh, imagine. See? That's what I'm saying. Building blocks. You're building your own. You're building things for your own self. You've been imagining. You've been... Um, manifesting uh, for some of you you have been watching these readings that I do and you're manifesting you know you have this deep knowing you know down deep inside what you deserve you know that you don't deserve what you've what you've had but with this person it's like round and round round and round you know things are going round and round in circles it's that type of feeling Wow. See, you, you've you got this big bunch of healing you've done. And they could just mess it all up. Angel card. Oh my goodness. See there. You're in full healing mode. And you're having your moments of loneliness. And that's when they're going to come forward. And it, it's risky. You know, don't let those moments of loneliness cause you to... to Make a decision that's going to hurt you in the long run. Okay, may we have one? Okay, we got two. Okay, you got amethyst and you got moonstone. These are the crystal oracles. But the, um, oh, it's like they've got angels attached. See? Okay. Um, amethyst, revealing your true self. See, that's transformation there. That's what you've got happening. Um, as you allow others to know the real you, you'll feel loved for who you truly are. And I feel like that's where you're, that's what you're doing. You're, you're moving into that. Okay, Moonstone. Moonstone, I'm sorry. See, this is the moon. This is Moonstone. Oh, I love Moonstone. I want to get me a bigger piece. Heightened intuition. Be extra aware of your inner, inner knowingness. As it is trustworthy. So that's telling you right there. You need to follow your intuition where this person is concerned. You need to um, make your decisions about this person, you know, um, with your eyes open. And, and see them from within, not just using your, your eyes. Okay. Ten of emotion. Life is blessing you with a wonderful and loving family. Great happiness and emotional fulfillment are now on the horizon. See, that's what I told you. The Ten of Cups is on the horizon. It's like you're right there. It's, it's like it's across the hill. Um, harmony with those you love is assured by offering forgiveness and understanding and kindness to others, you're rewarded. Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm sorry. You've got so much healing going on with unconditional love because I'm not sleepy at all. <laughs> Wasn't yawning before. Okay, then we're going to get one of these. 
So if you think you're not moving forward, you're wrong. You're moving forward. You just you just gotta know it. Um, okay, you got Flames of Wisdom Chrome number thirty nine. Let you look at that. See, she's got inner knowing. Look at that. It's like she just knows the magic's within her. Um, there's a, a you've got more of a, a connection to the divine than you know. I am open to all of life's wisdom and share it with gratitude. See, you're doing a lot of healing right now and people, you know, it's like you don't have lessons and, you know, they could be thrown at you to see if, if you're, you know, are you going to let that temptation grab you, basically. You're going to be tempted. <laughs> yeah. So we've got Archangel Michael here, which I'm glad showed up, and, and that was on the bottom, uh, number 16. I am grateful for the strength and courage Archangel Michael brings to my life. If you are, you know, you, you need strength to get through this, ask Archangel Michael to help you. So, this is what I have for you. Thank you so much for being here with me. I appreciate each and every one of you. And until next time, give me a thumbs up. Please do subscribe. Much light and love to you. Bye.